On now, PVR Inox has been in focus as the company saw strong sales this season. While uh, Shraddha Kapoor and Rajkumar Rao stars 3-2 saw stellar numbers at the box office, re-releases such as Rehenai Tere Dil Mein and SRK's Veer Zara are also drawing crowds. CNBC TV 18 Shilpa spoke to CEO of PVR Inox Pictures, Kamal Jiyachandani, and began by asking him about company's performance in quarter two. Listen in. Q2, uh, July and August have been extremely strong. And as you rightly mentioned, three has turned out to be uh, you know, something which never was expected to be this much. It was always expected it would do well, but mm -hmm. you know, the kind of business that we've seen is beyond expectations. Right. Uh, fortunately, a lot of other films have also done well. Mm -hmm. uh, Deadpool is another case in point, a film which did very well, and the fact that it was an adult film mm. uh, with with that rating for it to do that kind of business again uh, augurs well for theatrical. Surprisingly, the re-releases have also done well for us in uh, Q2. Uh, Tumbad, a recent release, uh, you know, film which came out pre-COVID, and it did fairly modest business, uh, but it was always appreciated. You know, critically, it was acclaimed. A lot of people saw it on streaming, and this is one example where. There is a positive cycle between streaming and theatrical. People saw the film on streaming. They wanted to see it. And they loved the movie. And because the theatrical experience is so differentiated, as soon as it came out in theaters, people are back in strong numbers. Mm -hmm. Given uh, how the rest of the year is expected to pan out, then do you see that, uh, do you expect an improvement in the average ticket prices uh, also because that sort of a di that sort of dip, and understandable because there were no big releases, but with very big releases expected, then how do you expect that trend to go forward? And while new re-releases are seeing 30 to 40 percent occupancy levels, for n how, how are you looking at the overall occupancy levels uh, settling in? I think on the ticket price uh, compared to last year, last year was about 258 rupees, the blended average ticket price. We will cross that. Okay. Uh, uh, will it be much higher? Uh, what percentage higher than last year? Difficult to comment at this point, uh, but we will definitely cross that. Looking at the lineup in Q3, uh, we feel fairly comfortable with the ticket prices where we are. In, in terms of uh, uh, overall occupancy, I, I think last year was about 26 percent. This year is also tracking around the same percentage. Uh, but I would say that the next year that we, you know, the next financial year that we have uh, with the kind of lineup, the films which have been sort of pushed to next year, both Hollywood as well as Hindi as well as Tamil Telugu, uh, I, I think we are pretty set for a very sort of strong next financial year much higher than what we have this year for right. sure right. Uh, and i think we will see numbers which would pretty much be the best numbers that we've had post covid well a very interesting conversation there with the management of pvr you know having a look at the mid